Hello my convicts, convict cats, just a desire to come convict bringing you guys and gals another video. So yeah, I'm doing another video today. As we all know, it's Monday and I'm going to be taking this one to the dentist. Uh, there's a special dentist place. We've got to take him today so he can go and have his teeth looked at. I was going to send him to school this morning, but it was kind of pointless. And I didn't really want to stream today either because it was being just the point of maybe an hour or something, then we had to stop the stream to get stuff ready and, and whatnot. So it kind of didn't make sense. So yeah, so I thought I'd keep him off this morning. He is back to school tomorrow, so don't forget the live streams are back tomorrow, half past until half past two, so don't miss them. Um, it will be on obviously a switch.tv forward slash Capricornvic. So definitely come over and say hello. Uh, I will obviously post out a quick video to say you know when I'm going live with but it's generally between half past ten half past two like I normally do anyway so there shouldn't be any issues and problems with that I've been doing a little bit uh, of BIOS tweaking to down the computer to see if we can get it running that little bit more optimized so I've been kind of looking at that this morning uh, he's got his dentist appointment around about one o'clock today which uh, it's not it's not too far away before we've got to get sorted and get ready for that. Um, so yeah, we'll be back to normal as per tomorrow and everything should be good. We should be golden and then get things prepared for what we need to do next um, in all things live streaming. So it's going to be pretty cool to get back. I'm glad to actually physically be back. Thank you also to Al and everybody else who obviously with a really nice comment saying glad you're safe, glad you're okay and that you've got better from COVID. We salute you, appreciate it as always. So thank you very much for all the kind words. It really does, you know, does fall on the heart, you know. Uh, I, I do love obviously to keep you in, you know, in all the know and all things obviously behind the scenes as well as obviously what's going on and hope that obviously everything's good as well. So um, thank you, I appreciate it. I really do appreciate it. Really does make a, you know, a, a huge difference to someone's morale when you know you've got people out there that are rooting for you and saying, yo, you okay, you good? So uh, yes, I am pretty much good. Have been luckily all the way through. It's not really been that much of a problem. So uh, yeah, thank you very much. It's been cool. But yeah, I'd be glad to be honest, to get back to live streaming, getting everything sorted and getting back on the way with what I need to do, obviously, in terms of live streaming and all that, uh, and making sure that everything is good because I, I do miss it and I absolutely hate missing. If I ever do live stream, I hate missing. Um, but yeah, that's just the way it is. Hopefully in the future, we can make some big differences and changes though. I would love to do live streaming full time and uh, um, maybe make some changes here in my personal life as well in terms of where I am, uh, where I'm at and where I'm going because uh, I, I do have a few bumps in the road unfortunately with Catherine and the way she is and just her behaviour in general. I would like to make some changes but I can only do that with the help of you guys and gals. You know, it's, it's, it's such an awkward situation to be in and with the whole whole issue where she doesn't believe in what I do and doesn't believe in you know the things that we're trying to achieve and no help and support towards what I do but yet she's quite happy to take all the help and support I give her through obviously caring for our son 24 7 while she goes to work 24 7 earning tons and tons of money and uh, support and sending clothes home that she sells and gets money through that and all the help she gets but I get nothing in return, you know? It's like she doesn't give me no money towards what she earns or what she gets help and support with. I only get the help and support I get because obviously I look after Rio, so I get the care of his money that helps to support him, that helps to support me to do what we do and obviously to run everything. And I'm trying to do YouTube to make money as well as obviously do what I love and enjoy, which is obviously playing games, which is what I've done since I've been very little to then going on and you know making it full-time career and hopefully becoming one of these big streamers and having a better internet connection and doing all these things i want to do right? and do these charity live streams i've always wished I, and hoped i could do and so on and so forth so it's frustrating 
It really is frustrating. And I know obviously I could do a lot better had I been given more time, but that's where we're, we're stuck with, you know, at the moment. And hopefully, like I said, if we can make a difference, we can change that and I could do it full time, then maybe I could look at finding an alternative abode, you know, and having my own house rather than being in this kind of situation and then seeing where we could go from there and just, you know, getting a better internet connection for myself. Because I do need to make some personal life changes. Um, whether it be this, whether I have to start working and sort of earn that money to get me to that point to then being able to do what I want to do. I don't know. So, um, you know, it's kind of one of those things where you're trying to weigh all of the different things happening and trying to push in the direction that I want to go, which would be to be able to do a full-time stream, have lots of people be there and obviously enjoy, you know, the, the time of having with you guys and gals, you know, to be able to live stream and do what I enjoy doing, which is gaming to push on with that, but also have security in the background to make sure that obviously I, there's a house I can pay for, that the rent I can pay for, so on and so forth. It's, it, it, you know, it's a catch 22 system, you know, that we get into. I see all these people making it and have all this money and support and help and all these people come every single day and then here I am since 2013 trying to do it myself and just don't seem to be getting anywhere and I just feel more that it's based on what's happening here behind the scenes with Catherine and everything that causes that issue rather than it be you know the effort and time I'm trying to put into it because if I had the time and the place to do it, then obviously I would do. But trying to explain to someone who doesn't care and doesn't want to listen is, you know, completely different. So every little bit of help you can help me with, every little thing you can do, and I'm not talking donations. Let's, let's take that and throw it away. It's about you being there, watching videos, being a part of the live streams, helping me to build more people in a live stream to getting maybe a hundred people or 10, 20, 30 people in a live stream per live stream. That will help so much more than ever, you know, doing any rubbish such as, you know, that crap with donation rubbish and what have you. It's about obviously being present. Now, obviously I know the time I live stream, probably not the best to live stream, but it's the only option I've got right now due to the fact that obviously I have Rio 24 seven and Catherine doesn't have them at all. Even now, the, all the days that we've had uh, the issue with COVID and everything, and obviously everything's got better within day after day after day. For me personally, uh, I felt quite okay all the way through. Rio doesn't seem to have been affected by it at all. Catherine didn't really have it that bad. She, she had it bad at the beginning and it kind of weakened off and then she got better and she just seemed to be better. But even then, she wasn't having him. I have him 24 seven still, even though she's been at home, not even gone to work for the seven days. She could have easily had them, uh, had him while I, I did live streaming uh, and did it like an evening. I even tried to do an evening live stream and yeah, I did it for a, a little bit and then it's like, oh, you've got to come and do this and that and the other. And it's like, I'm, I'm busy, you know, I'm busy. I'm trying to do something here. And I ended up having to leave and uh, leave the stream at it. So it's, it's annoying. I'm frustrated. I'm annoyed. And I'm just hoping that 2022 we can make a better deal of it. So if you can be there, please be there. Um, let's try and make... 2022, a life-changing year where I can completely wipe the slate clean and start again fresh. So, what do you say? Anyway, you know it is. A desire to keep convicts signing out. As always, I salute you, my convicts and convicts, my elites, who obviously hit that join button, support me for just $1.99 a month. 
you can support me and become one of my elites, whether it be on Twitch, whether it be on YouTube. I will try to make my best to make more videos and be more active on YouTube as well. I know some people's like, where did you go? And it's like, well, I'm, I'm live streaming on Twitch and then I forget to export from Twitch to YouTube. So obviously the live streams come to YouTube. So I need to make sure I do that more. I may make some changes though in the future to where we just have highlights from Twitch, but do videos from YouTube. This is again, the reason why I would like to try and make these changes that I need to make in order to make things better for everybody in uh, you know everybody out there and obviously everybody here as well anyway bye for now